Seemingly, everybody is talking about Roth IRAs now. You love the idea of a Roth IRA, but at the same time, you make just a little too much to be able to contribute to one. But it doesn't matter. You still want to do a Roth IRA. Is there a solution? Hi there. My name is Kenner French, and I'm with Vast Solutions Group. We're your tax and financial engineering firm for entrepreneurs. A lot of our clients are in the boat of wanting to open an IRA, though, frankly, they make too much money to open a Roth IRA, but there are creative ways actually for doing so. Now, you could sum up the appeal of a Roth IRA in three words, federal tax benefit. Potential earnings in a Roth IRA grow tax-free as long as the owner abides by the Internal Revenue Services rules. And by the way, withdrawals are federally tax-free once you reach 59 and a half and have held the IRA for at least five years. Unfortunately, some people make too much money to contribute to one. As I mentioned, in 2020, joint filers with modified adjusted gross income of $206,000 or more and single filers making $139,000 are not, are not eligible for a Roth IRA. There is a way for high earners to bypass these limits legally. By the way, it's called the backdoor Roth IRA strategy typically. High income taxpayers may create Roth IRAs indirectly. This involves a little maneuvering, but may be of interest to certain investors. The backdoor IRA strategy typically starts with the creation of a traditional IRA. The contributions to this new IRA are usually tax deductible because of the IRA owner's high modified, modified adjusted gross income. The new traditional IRA is fully or partially funded and with a financial professional's help, it is quickly converted to a Roth IRA and any tax liability is paid at that point. Why does speed matter in the strategy? Well, the longer it takes to convert the traditional into the Roth IRA, the greater the potential earnings of that traditional IRA. Now, since the traditional IRA's earnings convert to the Roth represent taxable income, those earnings should be minimal if the transfer is completed rel in relatively quick fashion. Now, in the above example, the IRA contribution is made with after-tax dollars, so the initial contribution amount is not subject to federal taxes. Now, keep in mind, this thought is inform informational only. It's not a replacement for real-life advice and or to speak with a professional who understands the ins and outs. Also, tax rules are constantly changing, and there's no guarantee that the tax treatment of a Roth or traditional IRA will remain the same going forward. Now the pluses and minuses. The big attraction is the potential for tax-free retirement income, not to mention tax-free exempt growth for the account. In addition, while mandatory annual withdrawals are required from traditional IRAs starting at age 72, no mandatory annual withdrawals are required from Roth IRAs while the original owner lives. Under the SECURE Act of 2019, most non-spouse beneficiaries of a Roth IRA are required to have the funds distributed to them by the end of the 10th calendar year following the original owner's death. Now, any Roth IRA conversion is a taxable event, and these conversions cannot be undone. Think about it. The basic rules for traditional IRAs are of real subsequence. Generally, distributions from traditional IRAs must begin once you reach age 72 and the money distributed to you is taxed at ordinary income. When such distributions are taken before age 59 and a half, they may be subject to 10.5 uh, 10 federal income tax penalty. Now, there's some specifics that are worth looking at. A lot of people are now rushing towards the Roth IRA door, if you will. If you have some questions, want to learn a little bit more about Roth IRAs or even traditional IRAs or really Roth 401ks, please look us up on the web, www.vastsolutionsgroup.com or give us a call at 888-808-8278. Now, these specific types of investments and plans sometimes really do make a huge impact on investors' portfolio. It should be in at least a thought in your brain to look at the Roth IRA conversion or specifically the backdoor Roth.